Soji Fagare here, enterprise expert. Mm. Really, really excited that we've done this much in terms of videos. And I was, I've said it earlier on that I feel as if I'm learning more and more about myself um, in the course of shooting these videos because I never ever realized that one could even possibly do this many videos in such a short space of time and with such consistency. So it's amazing how when you challenge yourself, uh, you can sort of get things done. So if you haven't been here before, this is Enterprise Experts. We are a community where we help uh, entrepreneurs who are either aspiring or established um, with business tips that should work for their businesses. So yeah, I mean, we help, we're, we're about helping, helping, helping others as much as possible. So we give plenty of free video content. We, we um, exchange uh, valuable information and um, yes, we, we, we just do so much um, in terms of helping, helping others. Today, I'm going to talk about service promise. Now, what do you mean by service promise? I mean, some people say, what's that service promise? So some people give you like a warranty or a, 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 a sort of standard that they say, look, this is the level of service we're going to provide for you. Whatever happens, we will give you 99% availability of our service. Whenever you come to our shops, we will give you, we will ensure that you go away satisfied. If you don't go away satisfied, we will compensate you one way or another. Now, that for me is the height of good customer service. And I mean, you probably say, why would I make that sort of promise as a business? I think one of the things about business owners and um, sustainability is that you need to have a system in place that ensures that you have a constant stream of customers coming into your business, um, uh, providing you with constant and um, um, consistent revenue. Now, the only way you can do that is if you have a loyal band of customers. And customers stay loyal to service. They stay loyal to uh, consistency. They stay loyal to quality. So if you offer them a level of quality that they can't find elsewhere, what do you think they'll do? They will always come back. You know, so what I would ask as a business owner is to craft your promise in such a way that it resonates with your audience, i.e. the people that are serving. And also, it also um, gives them value because at some point, giving people a, a promise that is of no value to them. So you must think of what um, things are of benefit to your customers, how much value your promise uh, gives to them, and uh, what difference the promise you make to them will make to their lives. You know, and um, yeah, so it's 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 amazing how much you know. Um, I know we've talked about over delivering and. Um, and under promising earlier on, and I, I, I think we've talked about this as well. So this is exactly what I what I mean by that. So as much as possible, ensure that whatever you do, you under promise and over deliver. You know, so that that's uh, that's my little tip for today. It's a very short video, and we're moving on very very quickly. And uh, yeah, we will catch up tomorrow. If you haven't subscribed to our video or to our channel. Uh, please go to www.enterpriseexpert.com um, or go to our YouTube channel where you'll find uh, the ability to subscribe. In fact, in actual fact, if you look on the right-hand side of this video, you'll see the subscription button there which allows you to subscribe. And of course, you can also get notified of whenever we uh, do videos as well uh, by clicking on the notification button. Very good being here and lovely talking to you this week.